Hi guys, Fujit here. Don't worry, it's not one of those silly videos I do uh, boom, boom, recently. This is a bit more serious. As you may or may not know, I'm actually an Englishman, uh, born and bred, although I now live in Dubai, in the UAE. And today, in my country, we had some pretty sad news in so far as His Royal Highness, Prince Philip, the Duke of Edinburgh, passed away at the age of 99. Now, ever since I've been around, Prince Philip has been around in the royal family, and I've always been a great admirer of his. Um, I had the pleasure of meeting him on a few occasions in my dealings in both the British Army and as a lawyer. And I've always found him to be a true inspiration to what a lot of people value. And today the world is a slightly sadder and lonelier place with his passing. He has been an institution. He has been an inspiration for many, not just in England and Britain, but across the world and I know he will be greatly missed. He's also been married since 1947 to Her Majesty the Queen, and I'd hate to know what she is going through at this moment in time. Because at the end of the day, whilst they may be royals, they're still human beings, guys. And my hearts and my prayers, my, my thoughts, go to the family that he leaves behind. But on the flip side, I'm sure that they've got some amazing happy memories and he will live on in those. That's all I wanted to say really, um, because I felt I needed to say something, because I think it is a sad day and I think we've lost somebody who was truly a gentleman and emboldened true British values, despite the fact that he's basically Greek Danish, <laughs> which is interesting. But today is a sad day and that's all I wanted to say really. Thanks for listening guys.